special people. Something special happened at San Diego every day. Something special happened at San Diego every day. But that's true, that's true. maybe some time away but already the two main political parties have been putting candidates in place to contest the polls but with fewer people turning out to vote in the last election there's a view that more effort needs to be put in place to address voter apathy to this end the electoral office of jamaica is turning its attention to that issue the 2016 general elections went down in the history books as having the lowest voter turnout with just a little over 47 percent of registered voters heading to the polls compared with the 2011 general elections where voter turnout stood at 53.17 percent and in 2007 61.46 percent so with voter numbers trending down the electoral office of jamaica has ramped up efforts to inspire a new generation of voters. This is the San Diego High School in St. Catherine, where voting is on in earnest. In this mock general elections, the Students' View Party, the Students' Progressive Party, and the Our Political Party are on the ballots. It really exposes us to um, the real elections in the future, voting for which political party we want to vote for. They're preparing us for life, and you know, it's a privilege because we feel Big. I always want to know how I'm doing it in real life because you know I'm not 18 yet, so excited. The EOJ's public education officer, Dania Harper, says the exercise is held at schools across the country. So we feel that if we can expose young people to the electoral process, that there wouldn't be this kind of apathy. They may not be so afraid to vote and they may not stay away from the process. Because once they have the experience, they realize it's pretty easy, it is harmless, it doesn't take long. And so we feel that this is an initiative that will encourage young people to go to the polls Leading up to mock election day, they had nomination day, the candidates collected their nomination form, they got their, the members to sign the nomination form, 10 members, 10 supporters to sign their nomination form, and the students pay a small fee upon presenting the nomination form. They also, the political leaders also had to sign a code of conduct. They had the political debate. They have been a bit loud, but they, they, you know, they are having fun while doing it, and I believe learning, and so it is good for them. In the end, voter turnout stood at 75%. The students' view political party won four of the seven seats. I'm the prime minister. Woo! Woo! I just wanted to win so that we can prove whatever was on our manifesto.